Hey, it's Chad with Flat Creek Farm. Do you have one of these? If not, you might need one. Let me show you why. This has got to be one of the most satisfying tools that I own. And that's because of two main reasons. One is that it's notoriously difficult to get tap roots out of the ground on weeds. Oftentimes weeds will break off at the ground and then they just end up coming right back. Whereas just with this tool, it's great at grabbing the root underneath the ground and popping it out, getting the entire root out of the ground and just totally taking that weed out of commission. The second thing is that it's so easy to operate. Before we continue on, if you guys like this content, please subscribe, leave us a comment, give us a like. We appreciate that support. So I think one of the reasons why this tool is so great is that it grabs a root underneath the ground. Whereas if you grab a weed where the green is up top, if you've done any type of weeding in the past, you know this to be true. If you grab the green, it'll break off, but you have to get down at the root. Well, you got to get your hands down or get a tool down in the ground in order to grab the root in order to yard it out. And if it has a tap root, it's really, really difficult to get out of the ground. This tool has a great design on the claw that allows you to grab the root underneath the surface. That root's a little bit more woody. And so if you grab onto it, it's less likely to break. And then the amount of leverage that this tool gives you by having a long arm on it and then having that foot lever that not only allows you to step it into the ground, but then rock it back and create a fulcrum, it allows you to pry that tap root out of the ground without breaking a sweat. And that's the second main thing that I like about this tool is how effortless it is to use. I set down my cup of coffee. This was a couple mornings ago, and I decided I was going to spend about five minutes out pulling thistles. Well, five minutes turned into about 15 minutes because it's pretty satisfying to uh, yard thistles out of the ground with so minimal, such minimal effort. And I started hunting for thistles and for other weeds so that I could pull them out of the ground because you really feel like you're accomplishing something, popping these things out of the ground. And plus, you know, my kids are always running around barefoot. And oftentimes I'm out strolling around in my flip flops, checking on water, checking on plants and stuff. And nobody likes to be getting their feet uh, in these thistles. So I thought that the design of this tool also was really, really good. I've, I've messed around with some other thistle pullers in the past, and the ones that I've seen have a little step that you can step in on, but then it has like a T-handle on the top, and you have to twist that thing in order to sort of make a little hole around it, and then you pull it out. So you're using your upper body strength in order to get this thing out of the ground, and then you have to clear it out with your hand as well. It doesn't, or you have to step on the thistle and pull it out. So you would have to have at least some good shoes on or some gloves. Whereas with this thing, um, it's totally hands free. The durability has been really good on it as well. Uh, I've I've pulled a lot of thistles and different types of weeds that have tap roots with this, and the the levers held up fine. The pump has never failed, and the ejector on this is is really really nice to be able to use. This one's made by Tack Life. And I know there's probably some other ones that are just as good. This is just the one that I'm familiar with because it's the one that I got and, and have been using. And it's a really inexpensive tool that f is really worth the its weight in gold. So I, I was out here pulling thistles and I thought, hey, you know what? Everybody needs to know about this tool. So I decided to make a video. Thanks for watching, you guys. And we'll... Uh, leave, leave me your thoughts down below. If you have one of these, if you are planning on getting one now that you've seen this video, and uh, happy thistle pulling.